Hello, my beautiful Labor Dragons. Welcome to your reading for mid-December. So, um, just so you guys know, there won't be any bonuses because I'm trying to get out the yearly predictions for all the signs. Um, there's a lot going on in December because the new moon also happens right in conjunction with the beginning of the month of January. So pretty crazy, pretty crazy to think that we're ready through 2021, right? Imagine what we thought, where we thought we would be, <laughs> right? You never know. So Libras, please do like, and subscribe. I do appreciate your support for the channel. The more you support me, um, the more that I can spend time doing readings. So if you really enjoy it, please share, um, comment, right? I love seeing the comments and I do put them up. Um, if you want to say something and keep it quiet, I can't respond. But if you want to say something, just mention it in the comment if you want to say something, which is fine. Um, but yeah, keep it nice. <laughs> keep it nice. You guys are always awesome. So let me get some cards for you guys. So one just fell. Wow, you guys are having a lot of a... Uh... Okay. Hmm. One more shuffle, then I'm gonna start the reading. Nothing's coming out. Okay, so let's see what's happened here. Wow. Okay, guys. So, ha! You guys have had a major falling out with somebody. Something is very imbalanced, and you've had a major falling out with somebody who's actually um, not a nice human being, okay? Somebody who's over controlling and may have a big ego. Um, now with that being said, um, I feel like you're being forced to be responsible in a way that you didn't expect. So somewhere there's been a massive, uh, stop in communication. So the cards that you guys have, okay, you have the chariot in reverse. I feel like you gave up. You just gave up on something. Okay. Because look at this, you have the chariot in reverse and you have the five of swords in reverse. Okay. So you're hurt, betrayed, and you have lots of angry anger. Um, you know, deep down why this has all happened and, um, and it really put you into negative thinking. Okay. Um, you need to be open to change, okay? The change that this is going to bring in because it is the tower, okay? So you have the emperor in reverse. Now, this could be a very heavy masculine, um, very heavy masculine, could still be a female, but this is, um, this is somebody very dominant and, uh, and I feel like they've really like super let you down because like you have this tower. The tower is here and this is sudden, okay? It's chaos and um, a lot of destruction, okay? It's, this is a time of breaking weak foundations, okay? So something has to get torn down and so that you can move on. You have to remember that the tower does not destroy anything that's beautiful. Okay, so the tower does not destroy anything that's beautiful. Super important to remember for you guys, okay? So let's go ahead and get some more energy. I feel like that either, like I feel that that's already happened, right? It's all sort of coming up. Oh. I'm interested to see what that card is. Whoa. is the Knight of Wands here. I want to see what's come out here. Yeah, you've had to change directions, okay? You've had to, um, you might have to approach something differently, but you've had to go and see and move, um, move forward away from this, okay? Um, and again, this Knight is about positive change forward. Um, it's about something moving forward positively. 
it's big. Okay. Um, yeah. You, whatever you're doing, you're making positive advancements. Yeah. High priestess in reverse. I feel like whatever happened that you had lost yourself. Okay. Um, I think you realize maybe where you, um, had a dependence on somebody, but, um, I feel like it, this really clouded you. I feel like this took you away, um, from who you are. Um, and I, I really feel that you were keeping it quiet. You weren't out about it. Um, it's like you couldn't see past it, right? It's like it happened and it was sort of out of your control and you couldn't see your way out of it. I just see like a fog and that's what the high priestess is. Cause when you have the high priestess in the upright, right? It's about vision and, and seeing and um, intuition. And I feel like this really blocked your intuition. You need to really go within, okay? You need to find your power inside so that it can guide you through this okay guys yeah so the ace in the past the ace of swords yeah in reverse this took all your power away this whole situation whatever it is it took everything from you okay you have the ace of swords in reverse and strength in reverse it took it all it took it all yeah and you have your nine of pentacles Okay. And, um, I feel like it left you very lonely. Like you didn't know where you were. Okay. So let's get forward movement. I'm being told to switch decks. So we're going to switch decks. Here we go. <laughs> let's see. Oh, good. These ones are getting slippery. Let's go. Yeah, somebody, uh, somebody was hanging on too tight and being too greedy with something. Um, it, it could be also that they're sort of, um, they're very vulnerable. Um, and there isn't a lot of trust going on back here. I feel like th this really was a bad thing. You have the six of cups in reverse. Now, um, I feel like whatever this happened, when this happened, even though you hit a tower, I feel like you couldn't get past it. I feel like that you sort of ran head into the tower and instead of taking it down, it really kept you there for a bit. Okay, can we get forward energy, please? Forward energy, okay? Look at this. Yeah, the page of wands. I love the page of wands. I'm going to show you guys the page of wands, okay? This came up for another reading, too. It's like, hi, guys. Hi. Right? It's like, hey, how are you? So we got the page of wands. So this is a positive message coming through. This is young and enthusiastic. It could have something to do with a child. Um, and because pages are children, right? So it could have something to do with, um, a young child, right? It could, if you have kids, right? This could be a situation involving them. Okay. So, um, yeah, look, you have the nine of pentacles twice in reverse. Okay. So it's like, Either this person or this situation left you dependent on somebody else for something to happen. But I think that you realized that you couldn't. Yeah, this was, um, <sighs> the nine of cups in reverse is telling you to relax and have faith in the universe. Okay. I feel like you've, um, you, you've, I think that that's what you need to do to get through this tower. You really need to reconnect with yourself. Um, there's somebody here being very greedy and, um, very materialistic and just, um, very, um, bitchy, right? Like you have this queen of swords in reverse here. Um, it could be somebody else in your life too, that has been really manipulative. Like it could be two people, right? With the emperor in reverse and the queen of swords in reverse, right? It could be two people 
that are just not behaving properly. Um, so let's go ahead. We're going to get, um, so guys, you need to go within. Okay. You need to create a new energy. Okay. You need to, you're going to overcome this and your fears and you're going to have positive movement forward. Okay. You need to remember that. Okay. You're going to, you need to make the choice to do it. Okay. You, and you will. Okay, and you really need to go inside and have faith in the universe. You need to just reconnect with yourself. I feel like this really left you extremely disconnected. Like I just see things sort of running around. And just connect with you. Okay? Just just connect with you. Card for Libra, please. Come on. Okay, next shuffle I'm going to take. Oh, I'm not taking a whole book, though, guys. Oh, and one came out. Sanctuary. Ha! Huh, what did I just say? Sorry, I didn't mean to haw you. But, um, Sanctuary, take time out from the world. Spend more time alone. Meditate or go on retreat. So you need to go and spend time with yourself. You need to go spend time with your soul, with your universe. Okay, Libra. This is how you're going to get out of this, okay? And go and spend time with the ones that matter. Yeah? Um, yeah, go where you're supported and spend time with yourself because you do matter, okay? I think that you really need to remember that. Okay, guys, um, please like and subscribe. I do appreciate your support for my channel, and I will see you in your next reading. Thanks, guys.